one of the questions that i get most often is that what are the books that are most useful in the preparation of gate biomedical engineering examination what i have shown here is a partial list of topics from the gate biomedical engineering exam although the standard books for all of these topics are very well known because they align with other engineering branches except for engineering mathematics and general aptitude most of the topics here are not important for the gate biomedical engineering exam because the gate bme paper is primarily focused on the biomedical section and the standard books or references for that are not known during the preparation of the key for the one of the most hardest papers gate papers which is the biomedical 2020 paper i came across many references that i think would be very useful in the preparation of future gate bme exams in this video i'm going to make suggestions on those references as a bonus i'm going to make some suggestions on how to deliberately practice or prepare very well for the upcoming gate examinations what i have shown here is the most important topics in the gate by bme syllabus other than engineering math and general aptitude i have shown the topic then i have shown the reference that is most useful for the gate preparation then i have also shown some references that are very useful if you want to deep dive into the subject and know more about it first let's get started with sensors and bio instrumentation the book that i suggest for sensors and bio instrumentation is a book by Corin Brown it's named introduction to biomedical equipment technology although the contents in this book might seem outdated it's very useful for gate preparation specifically some of the formulas or theory in this book as well as some example problems are very similar to the questions that showed up in bio instrumentation session of the gate bme paper in addition to this book if you want to deep dive i suggest you look at medical instrumentation book by webster or another very well known reference for this particular topic is that by kanpur for the second topic human anatomy and physiology the standard book is by gaten and hall physiology okay and if you want some additional reference that's more uh, theory oriented okay i also suggest kinner and snipe but in order to know anatomy and physiology i don't really recommend going through a really uh, bible such as gaten and hall okay uh, i would say it's not an efficient means to prepare for the examinations the necessary anatomy and physiology will show up in the books such as bio instrumentation book or the biomechanics book when and wherever such topics are dealt with it's good to know just that and i don't think most engineering students have time to deep dive into books like gaten and hall or kinner and sai although they are they are like the bible for the particular topic see for biomechanics the classic books are by professor yc fun unfortunately it's at a graduate level and not necessarily useful for gate preparation the book that i suggest is by susan hall is a basic undergraduate level book you get all the information on basic kinematics basic joints and types of joints levers and all that in the human body also very simple problems on force and moment equilibrium based on biomechanics of the body in addition to that if you want to deep dive into the subject i suggest you look at the book by nordin and frankel it's a book primarily used by clinicians orthopedic surgeons but if you want to deep dive uh, that's one of the book that i suggest the most take a look at it and see if you like it. see for medical imaging systems i suggest the book by bushberg is one of the most important topics in this list and uh, i suggest you start early with the book because it's quite big focus only on the topics that are there in the syllabus there are so many topics in the book there are so many chapters pick the chapters that are there in the syllabus and learn it because you need to know the subject in order to perform well in the exam books that would support the classic book or that by andrew webb there is also a book by s yes, webb 
I think it's pretty outdated. So if you want to understand more theory, there is this nice book by Andrew Webb on biomedical imaging, which is also useful. See, for biomaterials, it's a very rapidly changing field. I suggest you take some intro books like books by Sundar Rajan or like the book by Coates. Look at the chapters on biomaterials that should help you prepare for the gate exam. In addition to that, if you want a deep dive, good books are there by Bottia or by say Ratner et al. But those books are quite heavy and not necessarily useful for gate preparation. In addition to that, read research papers, specifically review articles on the different kinds of biomaterials. That's, that I think is one of the best ways to prepare for the gate exam. And also keep updated on what's going on in the field. And for practice, fortunately, there are so many topics in instrumentation engineering that aligns with important topics of gate biomedical engineering. For example, analytical, optical and biomedical engineering chapters are there in many gate instrumentation engineering books. I suggest you take a look at the questions that showed up in the previous years because such questions also showed up in the gate 2020 BME paper. There are also many test series that are very cheap and are available only. Second, subscribe to this channel. As I am doing with the gate BME 2020 paper, I will be uploading more videos on gate type problems as well as basic theory and logic behind biomedical engineering topics. Third, in addition to subscribing, I also invite you to participate in the comment session of each of the videos in this channel. Participate, have a discussion with your friends and colleagues, which is one of the most efficient ways to learn the subject. Good luck. I'll see you with another video.